One less enemy to worry about. Aha! So you're the fuck who gate crashes my party, huh? Maybe next time you wait for an invite to the school dance. But then maybe there is no next time for you, shit. Is that jacket for real? Wow. And I thought the mansion was tasteless. Let's see how funny you are when I cut out your tongue, buddy. Big talk for someone dressed like a seat cover. Who the fuck are you? Where did you come from? And where the fuck are my guards? I told your guards to go home and go to bed. That jacket was so bright they couldn't sleep. What the fuck did you say? Oh, so you can't hear me over your jacket either. No wonder it was so easy to sneak in here. You came for a fight, you got one, buddy. Put on your red shoes. Let's dance. The jacket. Messed up my jacket. Got all this blood on it. With that color scheme? How can you tell? Why the fuck did you come here? Did I kill someone you know? Shoot your fucking dog? Fuck your girl? I was just stopping by, saw the lights on, figured I'd see who was home. And no, you didn't shoot my girl or fuck my dog. Then, what is all this shit? That's exactly what I asked when I saw the decor in here. <laughs> Sergey, Sergey, buddy. Why do you not stand up? Give me a hug. Oh, you bleeding all over the place. Mike did a number on you, eh? Mike here, and he's a big talker. He talked about this, I talk about that, and then we talk about you, old man. Now I think my knife starts to... No! You want to watch my knife speak to this bag of shit, Mike? Or I give you a call when we're done talking, eh? After all I've been through, I'd like to watch this play out. I put on a show. Watch this. No, no, please, don't! 